everyone in uh, in winter semis gets guaranteed fifth. So let's see these players play their hearts out. So I was right with the switch. Uh, Skeleton opting for the Terry here. I think that's a smart pick considering. We've all seen Riddles versus Sonic yeah, when it he goes Kazuya. Unironically tried and true. Riddles has done this way too many times, so it's... Yeah, and it's always reverse 3-0, too. You can't reverse 3-0 if you're starting off with... You can't reverse 3-0 with Terry if you're starting off with Terry. Yeah. I, it doesn't work like that. I mean, but if you're Skeleton, you might. You know, it wouldn't surprise me. As long as he gets reverse 3-0, it is with Terry. Terry, Terry does have... Terrence? Not, not as much, but... Close to the amount of, yeah. uh, of uh, Henry, <laughs> let's, say, let's say robbery that, that cause you can yeah. then pull out. Henry W13 gets it. Yeah, Garden Warfare is raw, dude. Damn. I love Garden Warfare. <laughs> See, I'm not the only one. No, I guess not. <laughs> um, so as we're seeing here, OMJ just sticking to their game plan, going coast to coast, catching Skeleton over extending Earth. And you can't blame him. This is that. This Friday is the win condition. This is the win condition against Shotos and a fortunate SD from Skeleton. Yeah, Skeleton getting a little bit annoyed there. OMJ might be able to take advantage of that and play even more campy, but I can't blame them. It's you play to win the game. Oh, oh then I'm going to see a power. See, I'm pretty sure this is this still isn't like an even matchup or, or even uh, winning matchup for for Terry. This Sonic is... loses. Sonic loses three matches. Okay, total. okay, okay. We're going to do this. <laughs> Where do you put him? Where do you put him? Top three. Top eight. Top three. Top three. Okay, no, I I, I can respect that. It's the Joker, uh, Sonic. Joker over Sonic? Oh, okay, but like that order. I feel like it goes in any order. I, I, okay. on I, I, I can kind of understand. Or if uh, you really want to optimize Kazuya. He's fully invincible. The whole it's going to happen. It's gonna yeah. Someone's going gonna, someone's to get the box and fully optimize. Nito. Nito. Yeah, Nito and Wilds. Wilds coming out. I, I forgot Wilds was a, a box player. Uh, Skeleton actually able to take the stock. Not, not trying to... Uh, give OMJ any any chance to build an even bigger lead. Yeah. For Gone Wild? Oh, okay. Oh! <laughs> Gone Wild, thank, thank you, Grant. <laughs> I didn't uh, need to know that. I oh. learned something new today. Oh. Where, where is that Delta going? Not, not towards Sonic. Uh, Terry forgot how to auto turn around actually, it's been so long. He forgot how it worked. <laughs> oh, that would have been cool, but uh, OMJ reacting that and laying out that spin chat. I'm pretty sure, that, pretty sure the invincibility of the, sp of the spin dash working out in OMJ's favor. Yes. Was that a kill my dove? Uh, no. Um, the player I was worried about lost. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I see, okay. Um, no, but kill has gone. That's unfortunate. Yeah, uh, we probably won't see him back for like a year. <laughs> but average working man. Skeleton working out this. Trying to make sure we see him in the next round with this. Uh, making this a lot closer than what we thought it would going to be, considering that first stock. And with Go, he has every option here to kill. Except for that one. Cross up actually working against him. That's really unfortunate to see. But considering he SD'd. Stock one. This is going about as well as he could hope for. You know, honestly, yeah, it's not going as bad as I thought after an SD. Yeah, and then Skeleton able to keep composure as best he can. Yeah, and timeout's still not on the table yet, so he's he's got that to look forward to. No timeouts so far. OMJ is going coast to coast. That B button is getting pressed. <laughs> wow, what a jab. His shield was almost gone. Yeah, no, that, sh that shield is a skittle. And that back air. Actually not killing him. And the Ooh. F smash. Skeleton opted for that high recovery. Definitely not something you want to do against Sonic. That's a sword move. Skeleton. I, I don't care what he said. That's a sword move. It is, dude. His hand, like... Extendos. His hand el elongates. And elongates. Then, and then spans. It's like... <laughs> It's like when you get a sock and a rock and you do this. And you're winging it around like a mace. <laughs> yeah, it like extends out. <laughs> um, Skeleton getting a bit frustrated there, shaking his head after that game. A bit lost on what to do here. Definitely not out of the realm of possibility. I, I do believe Definitely that Skeleton not. does have a little bit of gas left in the tank. Definitely he does. It's just, does he have enough to win three games? 
It, it is a best of five, so anything can happen. Yeah, including getting burnt out, which is not something you want to see either of these players do, but as Sonic, it's kind of your goal sometimes to just burn your opponent out on all the decision making. That, that would be the hard part of Sonic timeouts is being able to, to not only willingly go for the timeout, but also make the right decisions to do that. Make the right decisions and also not burn out yourself. Yeah. I can understand that being a very, very big uh, wall to climb over but, um, for Sonic actually, players. Most Sonic players play a ton of Wi-Fi, so they probably do have the stamina to do that. They, so. they are born in that environment. They, they, they are. They are born to timeout. After this set, I'll tell you a story from this one Sonic made. It's so <laughs> no, funny. No. Oh, no. Don't tell me this is a last talk story. It's a last talk story. It's a last talk story. Of course it is. <laughs> Last stock stories are the best. OMJ getting really, really friendly with that F smash. Um, I mean, it, it's being friendly right back, taking those stocks super early. Your skeleton, what do you do here? Did, wait, did dash attack just trade like, with side B? Yeah. <laughs> Damn, okay. Maybe that's a new strategy. <laughs> I mean, if you're skeleton, you rather trade than just get straight up hit. The one in hundred chance of trading, I, I don't, I don't think you can reliably do that. <laughs> yeah. It's like all of his specials put him in a very punishable position. This might yeah. be it. Yeah, OMJ's selling way too much at catching skeleton's landings. And the lead grows ever bigger. Almost left. Damian Lillard just got shot, uh, signed to the Heat. My go. <laughs> um, oh, he actually didn't tech it. I think it's probably better for him because uh, they got that positioning above the stage to come down with spin dash. Probably. I'm more worried on like the. I I, I guess you want to call it RNG if you get sent up or oh, sent yeah. down if you get stage spiked by it. Yeah, right. By the ledge or got, by the slant. He got signed to Heat. <laughs> we got basketball fans in the chat. Oh, let's go. Um. So. Skeleton um, trying his best to try and even this up, but it's honestly it's all hard. you need. All you need is even stocks. Yeah. As Whoa, long as you have even stocks, anything is possible. It's actually a, a Buster Wolf out of the corner. Yes, those go moves so huge and so active. Nair and the Fort will be taking that stock. Skeleton visibly mad in the, in the player cams. Not liking this Sonic one bit. OMJ is, I mean, he's he's just catching his landings over and over again. He, yeah. he, has, the, he has the read on it. They have the data, and they're using it to beat him. I, it's not, it's I, almost like they're playing Smash Bros. It's like the top player thing to it's do. It's like they're playing a fight game. Dude, no way. <laughs> this is a party game. I love party games. Mario Party side bracket when? I'd, I'd, I'd play. I'd play that side bracket. Uh, no, they just... Ooh. No, they didn't trade. Not they a, just not signed. A... Oh, really? Okay. My eyes might be playing tricks on me. <laughs> um, so, your skeleton here is... I say, skeleton's getting a lot of parries in, in the it, matchup, but he's not really getting is, much is out of it. If you're parrying side, but you're still not getting anything off, so you don't have something big and disjointed like a, like a Steve up smash to punish. <laughs> um, I don't know why you're bringing up Steve up smash. So it's... Isn't the scoop like not that big on Steve Up Smash? No, it's huge. Really? It's the main counterplay for Steve on Spin Dash. Okay then. Oh. Oh, and the SD. I never, I now regret looking away. Your OMJ, you gotta be feeling very confident going into this game three. They very, very solid. Uh, you said the reverse 3-0 is possible in. Skeleton's got this if he's, uh, if he focuses up, picks the right stages, and picks his times. I'm sure he can get it, but OMJ sitting very happy. I need the skill of Steve. Don't the do that, Skelton, please. <laughs> do, 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 do what you feel is right. The Roy. The Sephiroth. Personally, I think Skelton... I was kidding. Uh, dude! I was kidding. He's on the screen. <laughs> He's my goat. <laughs> Skeleton with the awesome pick of Minecraft Steve. So, 
If you don't know, this matchup is actually awful for Steve. But it's Steve, so he can win any matchup. Um, just the explosiveness factor of Steve. Yeah. Just but getting touched by Steve. OMJ having the experience since uh, they came from DFW, underscore Trey5, DJ Don, Yanni, uh, every other player in that scene, because they all play Steve. So. Oh, so you're saying he probably has the... I think OMJ probably has the matchup down. If you're yeah. Sonic, it's, it's really not that what, tough. What region is OMJ? I actually don't know. Well, they rode here with Cake and Atomic, so I'd assume so DFW. DFW. Okay. Yeah. We only have one Houston player, and I think they're out of bracket now. Poor Zohar. No way. They won against Kusanagi. Really? So I fight them. So nice. it'll be casting up the diamond here. I, I don't agree with that, considering Skeleton's oh, yeah. at such a high percent. Oh, right. We got the Steve player on the mic. <laughs> so um, you do fight Zohar. OK. So so barely the main counterplay here for Steve is to post up and wait for them for their neutral timer to run out and then try and get a quick lead and then just sit back and hold that lead and counteract Steve a lack of like make up for Steve's lack of mobility in this matchup by just turtling. Ooh. But Fair Fair barely whiffed. And yeah. he, or the the diamond fair barely whiffed and OMJ was able to get uh the forward air off of it. Fair for the edge guard. Which, you know, I've been seeing a lot of these up air ones, but I, I haven't really seen them do anything. I wonder. I say, like, you think you think that's intentional, or is it just a mistake? I think it's supposed to have the second up air, and they do like a, another up air or back air, but uh, I just don't know. Hmm. Stand up the wall, <laughs> immediately destroyed. Uh, skeleton actually able to keep quite a bit of materials here, which. It's good, but I feel like there's definitely like a lack of block usage and a lack of discipline coming out with his iron options, which is something really big you need to have against Sonic. Is you need to be able to keep on those iron options. As soon as you're out of iron, you're you're pretty much dead because you have no disadvantage tools that really beat out Sonic. Oh, he tried to pull out the side, uh, the minecart. Yeah, not realizing he has no iron, but OMJ fully aware, able to go out so much more for these edge guards, considering Elytra loses its hitbox so early into its uh, its span. Probably gonna be death here. Yeah, Guess no hitbox. I like the option of not going for the uh, breaking the craft table to keep OMJ's moves a little bit more fresh and considering. Okay, Steve. <laughs> um, getting up tilt combo here. Getting a quick 50%. That's a, that's a nice combo coming from Skeleton. So, this is definitely still heavily favored in OMJ's favor. I don't oh. even think diamonds matter at this point. OMJ giving <laughs> giving him a... A few minutes. A little, little bit of breathing room. You know, Skeleton just went to sleep, so monsters despawned for a little bit. So... Waiting, waiting for daylight to come by. Yeah. The navigation around these minecarts and iron options is really strong. See, that's the thing. Enderman doesn't burn in the daylight, so... It doesn't matter too much. Yeah. Oh, Jay, <laughs> having fun on that platform. There's, there's not really much reason to approach, so can't really blame him. That back air barely whiffing with the good movement from OMJ avoiding it. Wow, they are able to play right outside of Steve's range. It's crazy, knowing that the anvil is going to come down there, resetting the situation back to a neutral. I think the next interaction here from uh, OMJ probably takes it. That was a oh, that that that, that, that could have been like the game scenario. Off yeah. stage, edge guard. Oh. oh. All right, that, no, that was that was very smart skeleton. He backed up just so the uh, the what's it called? Homing attack. Homing attack. Him. So the homing attack would just oh, go straight and down. Oh, up smash gonna take it, bring it down the last dog. This is the best position we've seen him in. Maybe the Steve's the pick if he's able to clutch this out. All right, now here's the zero death. <laughs> he just gets the doom. But don't. And then. <laughs> you just shanks him. <laughs> Get, Sh shank the hedgehog. Oh, I hate this hedgehog. <laughs> um, the minecart use being very heavy here. Almost no iron out. I think but, I think this is the the first time we're seeing a skeleton with a decent amount of gold or iron. 
No, no, or iron too, but just gold. I haven't seen a powered Minecraft uh, minecart. In and that Nair gonna be taking it. OMJ three oming skeleton on all three of his characters.